Good evening, gentle bodies, and welcome back to Let's Play Tales of Fantasia. Yeah, look at us with our little cape, we're awesome. Oh, shit. Uh, <laughs> I am your host, Lucas13, and we're kicking some bugbear ass with, you know, sharp pointy swords, which are always fun, especially around kids. I don't know about you guys, but that's going to be my kid's first birthday present. That and lots and lots of content. What? No, I, I, no, no one else? Okay, just me. Um, but anyway, last time, we were flung into the distant past by our, uh, friend, I, I don't know, I don't know if I want to call him a friend. He did kind of throw us into the past. I don't know about you guys, but the past sucks. Like, it, it, it always sucks. It always does. Really. We're going to explore the forest, because... I don't know why, but we're going to, just cause. I think there's a few minor items here and there, I'm not sure though. We're going to fast forward through this shit and kill somebody. Um, how have you guys been? Yeah, yeah I tell you, it's been one hell of a week. It is, oh god, you don't even know. First, I went to the dry cleaners, you know, yeah. And, and I was just like, I was trying to get this shirt, and he was, he just wasn't having it. The guy behind the counter, he just wasn't having it. He didn't believe me. What? Oh, here we go. Remember this forest. Hmm, magical tree. Total not plot device. Woo! Okay. And, wait, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. So I'm trying to get this shirt from this guy, right? And he just, he doesn't. Believe me when I say I drop one off here. He's just like, I don't know what you're talking about, sir. Please leave. And I'm just like, bitch, you know I dropped it off here. I remember your name, Habib, or whatever your name was. And I, I don't really remember his name, but you have to, you have to mess with people. Um. So anyway, it turns out it, it wasn't a laundromat, and it was the police station, and I was in jail. I think I told that right. Uh. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. So yeah, we just we just found out we just went through that forest so he could remember. Shit, that was fun. Let's find out where the fuck we are. Wow, that is some mighty fine pine. Is it me or does the past have better graphics? What the fuck happened? I think when you go to the future, everything becomes less graphically intense. How ironic. Hello! What do you want? I just want to... You haven't got shit, do you, lady? Nope. She just has life bottles and medicine. Much bullshit. Who needs that shit, really? When I grow up, I'm going to be the greatest sword... Well, how about you challenge me right here, kid? I will slay you with my man sword. Yeah. Wait, what? What do you got? You guys are disgusting. Seriously. Oh, <laughs> you don't say. There's caves all around here. Well, you know, I don't know about you guys, but I've never seen a real-life cave where all these adventures supposedly take place. I thought they were rare. But, you know, what do I know? Maybe all the adventurers just, you know, cleaned them out a long time ago. Gotta get dinner ready. Wait, aren't you... Yeah, you're an old guy. Wait, what? <laughs> He's like, I gotta cook for my daughter. She's, you know, 11, so she's going to be bringing home a husband soon. Hmm, medieval times were sure fun, man. Ah, oh, God. I always laugh whenever people say, and I wish we had lived in a simpler time. And I'm like, no, no, you don't. Just, just trust me on that. No, you don't. Villager, look, everyone outside is... Oh, Jesus, they're gonna burn us at the stake. Uh, uh, burn meant first. She actually heals, uh, you know guys like that shit, right? Burning healers? Yeah. They're just kids. What do they want here? Why do they want our children's bum holes? What? What are you guys talking about? I just came here from the future, goddamn. This looks like a home. Oh, Master Roshi. Hi. It's good to see you, bro. Excuse me. Where are we, Master Roshi? You are on my Roshi Island. Just motherfucker. You will train with me, and I will teach you how to do the Kamehameha. Be prepared. That shit ain't easy. 
But you'll probably grow on, go on to do it way better than me anyway. You faggot. Oh, well, aren't you a little bit bitter, Master Roshi? Just a little bit. Yeah, this is my, this is my, uh, my hot date, Mint. <laughs> Totus. Never heard of it. Anyone ever heard of Totus? Nope. We're just ignorant villagers. We don't know shit. <laughs> They're all just like, uh, sorry, bro. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Uh, hope you're good with that. No one seems to know anything about this totus of yours, but for some reason I don't think you're lying to me. Is it possible you were sent here by magic? And you know, key and, and all that jazz. Is, I, I, my wife tells me about these things. <laughs> what the fuck's magic, man? Okay, seriously, how do you grow up in a world where magic was actually possible and not know anything about it, as opposed to a world where it doesn't exist and everybody fucking knows what magic is. I guess because magic just becomes history then and who likes history? <laughs> Nobody. Yeah. Well, we don't know who you are, but let me invite you into my home. You seem like good kids. And be sure to leave your clothes at the door. And you little girl, make sure to rip your panties off. <laughs> Let's check out these faggots. I say we burn them. Damn you, medieval folk. Why do you gotta ruin everything? My name is Lenios. Oh no, I, that's my real name. I'm Master Roshi or Lenios Roshi. It's my favorite name. Village Elder. There's always a Village Elder. Because everybody listens to the old ass. I know that name from somewhere. Yeah. If only old people were actually this smart in real life. <laughs> Please. I can't believe you never heard of magic, God! You're such new fags. <laughs> what? You believe you don't know mana? It's the power of healing. Oh. Well. Wait, you know? Wait, what? No, don't do it, Mint. No, he'll burn you at the stake. No. <laughs> I don't. Well, I feel great. Thanks. I don't know how you did that, little girl. He's just like, you're such a dumbass. So magic is like this. Fireball! No oh shit, son! You just you just burned the fucking Oh my god! You set the orphanage on fire! What the fuck, man? What are you doing? And why are you freaking out, class? You can you can launch lightning from your fucking feet. He just shot a fireball. I think yours is a little bit cooler. Oh, no shit, yeah. <laughs> Defeating Tahos? Don't be stupid. <laughs> You're such new fags. You know who Tahos is? Of course we know who he is. He's the most inhuman fiend in the world! You know, besides Frieza. <laughs> the EBZ jokes. Every day his army conquers more of the world. But Dahos was just released. What are you talking about? Dahos is... Ah, has been in power here for over a decade. He must be in a different time period. Hmm, time travel. Hmm, this is gonna make my brain explode, ain't it? Yep, there it goes. Is this our future? No. No, everything's made of wood, you idiot. Why would it be our future? The house is, it has to be our past, of course. It makes total sense. Of course, Lenios, you're the man who founded Dotus. <laughs> just like, I don't know what the fuck you guys are talking about. Oh, you s This is the... Wow. <laughs> wow. 4202. That's pretty fucking... That's pretty fucking far in the future for us. Wow. I don't know about you guys, but I hope this isn't our future, just... I, I don't think I really like the old wooden houses as our future 2,000 years ahead of us. Jesus Christ. I think I'm gonna faint. 
<laughs> oh, there, look what you did, you son of a bitch. I had to run, go run into that fucking orphanage and rescue all the kids myself. Now, I'm covered in soot, and I just got fucking third degree burns all over my dick. What did you do? <laughs> like, whoopsie! Quit being such an asshole. Oh, God. This is amazing. I can't believe it. Visitors from the future. Can you tell me a winning lottery ticket number? Uh, we live in medieval times. There's no such thing. Don't play stiff with me, boy. I know you know something to get me money. Wait, I think that's supposed to... You know what? Never mind. <laughs> There's no other explanation. I know it's too much to ask for you to believe us, but please tell me more about Dahos and magic. Yes, of course. Mm, yes, mm, yes. I'm going to stroke my beard methodically. Mm, Dahos can only be hurt by magic. That's why Alvanista and, wait, Alvanista and Midgard are researching it. The problem is that you can't use magic. Really? Why not? I can shoot lightning from my fucking feet. If that's not magic, I'm fucking impressed. What is? Humans can't use magic. Only those with the blood of elves can. So then why can I like... You know what? Never I'm gonna stop asking. <sighs> well, pure blooded, blooded elves are half elves. That's the only where... Yep, because everyone knows the elves have to be magical. I swear to God, I'm going to make a fantasy world one day where the elves are the barbarians. And the fucking just... <laughs> the orcs are just, We know the most magic! <laughs> you can find someone who's willing to help you in the fight against Ahos, of course. Is there anyone you can think of? So you're really thinking about going after Ahos. There's some big conies on you, bro. Some big, huge, sweaty balls. Okay, we don't need to know that much detail, Master Roshi. Oh, you're gonna listen. Of course. That's why we were sent here. Perhaps. But. That's a big, hairy butt. Okay, please quit it, Mr. Roshi. You're kind of creepy. <laughs> you have to do something for Tornix and... Chester's say Chester's gay. I don't know about you guys, but I think he's gay. <laughs> I, I just I don't like him. He's not my style. Hmm. An Iluka an Il Il elucid north of here, a man by the name of Cloth F. Lester has devoted his life to studying magic. I could pronounce good words, yes. He's a stubborn fool and may seem standoffish though. Thank you for all your help. <clears throat> it really was my pleasure. My deep, unsatisfiable pleasure. Mm. You look tired. I'd be honored if you'd stay the night here so I can probe you for further questions. <laughs> well, thank you. Thank you, sir. You're awfully kind, but, uh, yeah. I'm about ready to hit the sack. Yeah, me too. Uh... Class, um... What is it? Hmm? There's two of us and, uh... Only one bed. <laughs> what? Hmm... I don't see what you're getting... Oh, ho, 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 ho! You dirty thing, you! I wasn't trying to fuck you, I promise. I'll just sleep on the floor because I'm a gentleman. 